2007, here in Carmarthenshire, there was a very smooth transition from community planning to the local service board. And here we were one of the six pilots. And of course, what we did was we built very much on partnership working, which we prided ourselves on. And indeed, the local service board has certainly taken that up and we've gone from strength to strength. So what we have found, by working in real true partnership, proper collaboration, we have been able to deliver far better services and, of course, given a much better value for every pound that we spend. And this DVD will show you what uh, we've been able to achieve in the last five years. And what I would like to assure you is that we will continue to work in true collaboration and I think that the integrated community strategy that we've put together again shows the whole of Wales the way forward. Our way of life is changing. People are living longer with a higher quality of life. But with that, our care needs are becoming more complex. The Carmarthenshire Integrated Community Equipment Service pools equipment held by the Council and the Health Board and is used to help people to remain as independent as possible. When people do have to access services, it is important that they have the best quality. The newly built Cwm Air Extra Care Scheme in Llanabyddar is designed to enable older people to live independently in self-contained homes with appropriate levels of care and support. Hawilvar Health Board has recently opened a world-class breast care facility at Prince Philip Hospital, thanks to a £7 million investment from the Welsh Government and public donations. A number of factors can have an impact on our health and well-being, including housing. The Carmarthenshire Home Standard Programme aims to improve 9,200 council homes. A pilot health impact study has shown a clear link between home improvement and health improvement resulting in less visits to GPs. Rydw i'n meisiau bawb yn sir gair fyrddyn cael y dechrau gorau posibl mewn bywyd, gan gael y sgiliau, gwybodaeth a'r cyfleoedd i ddiw bywydau hapus, iach a llawn. Mae'r awdurdod lleol wedi bod yn gweithio ar y cynllid moderneiddio addysg gwerth 200 miliwn o bunnoedd dros y chwe mlynedd diwethaf, ac wedi cyflawni cryn gynnydd wrth hwylusor traws newid a moderneiddio eiddo ysgol yn Sir Gairfyrddin. Mae cynllun cadetiaid Sir Gairfyrddin, cynllun ledled y Sir, yn gael ei arwain gan goleg Sir Gair a chyngor Sir Gairfyrddin, yn cynnwys gweithio gyda nifer o badneriaid yn y digwydiant adeiladu, i greu gweithlu cynaliadwy wrth gysylltu hyfforddiant a chyflogwyr. Mae'r badneriaeth wedi creu nifer o fentrau llwyddiannus gan gynnwys y cynllun prentisiaeth rhannu sydd wedi tynnu dros 30 o gwmniau adeiladiaeth i gilydd i rhannu dros 70 o brentisiaid. Rydym hefyd wedi gweld coleg y drindod yn datblygu i fod yn brif ysgol y drindod Dewi Sant. Mae hyn wedi arwain at welliant yn ansawdd a safonau academaidd gyda'r brif ysgol yn gallu cynnig mwy nag erioed o fewn cyfyrdrannau y celfyddydau, astudiaethau cymdeithasol, addysg a dyniaethau. Carmarthenshire remains one of the safest areas in the UK. Crime levels are very low and the David Powers Police Force area as a whole is the safest region in the whole of the UK. One key factor in achieving this success over the past five years has been the work of the neighbourhood policing teams that operate throughout the Carmarthenshire area. The aim is to achieve safe and secure neighbourhoods through providing a service which is tailored to local needs. A multi-agency approach is also taken to address road safety and speeding in the county. Carmarthenshire has developed an effective road safety strategy in partnership with key organisations with the aim of reducing the number of people killed or seriously injured on our roads. Since implementing this strategy, we have reduced the number of people killed or seriously injured by 55% over the last 10 years. 
Carmarthenshire also provides a wide range of support services to assist people affected by substance misuse. With £530,000 of Welsh Government funding, a centre was opened in Vaughan Street, Llanelli, to develop a multi-agency base which delivers a range of substance misuse services Sheer Gairvardin Garth Cymru. An Adna Bathis am a Chemineda I'm Ruiol, I am Gulchev Natirial Guich. Rath Project Chemineda I Digarbon, Siv Menter Rekir Tonga Shantaith and Nishir Gar and Menter Kum Gwendaith, and Canus Gossod Paneli Solar are Doyai Taira Thego I Dilada Chemineda and Sheer Gairvardin. My Dishkulir project gwerth can now de Gagino Binoith ile hai a Lleriad Carbon Dai Oxide Blynyddol o 24 Tynnell a Dishkulir y Cymunedau i elwa dros 1 miliwn o Binoith dros y 25 mlynedd nesaf. Bwc y bys yw'r gwasanaeth bws lleol arloesol cwbl hygyrch sy'n ymateb i'r galw ac sy'n gweithredu yn nyffryn teifi ers aws 2009. Gwasanaeth ydyw sy'n cael ei ddarparu yn ôl anghenion y teithwyr mewn pentrefi gwledig gan eu clido i drefi, pentrefi neu ganolfannau ar hyd taith y gwasanaeth bws 465 o Gairfyrddin i Aberteifi. Mae'r gwasanaeth wedi cael ei gydnabod am fod yn arloesol ac wedi ennill dwy wobr trafnidiaeth genedlaethol yn 2010. Carmarthenshire is a county at the forefront of new ideas, building on its high-quality environment, community, culture and dynamic economy. We have seen a significant amount of investment in retail and leisure facilities around the county. The opening of the 15,000 capacity Park Scarlet Stadium has led to a major boost to the local economy and the creation of over 200 jobs. The first new all-purpose turf horse racing track created in the UK for 81 years was opened at Foss Lass. This has seen the creation of 15 full-time jobs, flowing a multi-million pound development by the private sector which was supported by the council. The £74 million pounds development of St Catherine's Walk Shopping and Leisure Complex in Carmarthen attracted more than 4 million visitors in its first six months whilst Park Pemberton Retail Park in Llanelli opened following an investment of £75 million, creating around 700 retail-based jobs for the town. A new one-stop shop for the voluntary sector was established at the Mount, bringing an old building back to life. This was a joint venture between partner organisations worth £1.9 million. I'm Chris Martin, Chairman of How Are Thy Health Board and very proud to be the Vice Chairman of the Local Service Board in Carmarthenshire. I hope you will agree that as a county we have made great progress over the last five years and have much to be proud of in the spirit of true partnership working. We have all worked extremely hard to make sure that we provide the best possible services for the people of Carmarthenshire. But there's more to be done and in the future the LSB will strive to deliver more efficient and effective services rise to the challenges, find innovative solutions and break down the artificial barriers between organisations for the benefit of all living and working in the county. You will be pleased to hear that we will be focusing on the five key outcomes of the strategy we have outlined in this film. But we need your help, understanding and support to really make a difference. Because together we can make sure that Carmarthenshire has the best public services in Wales. Thank you. Die Ochen